There is an achievement in RoboQuest which requires you to reach the maximum armor bonus, which seems like quite a daunting task, but by selecting the proper upgrade skill, this is more than easily achievable in just one single run. So there are several ways in which you could accomplish this, but I'll just tell you the best and easiest way possible. Start off the game on the difficulty of your choice. Go for discovery if you're only chasing after the achievement to make your life a little bit easier. Make sure you start the game as the engineer, as it's the class that most easily achieves maximum armor without too much effort. So here's how it goes. The maximum armor in RoboQuest is of 60%, so that's the percentage we'll be aiming for here. And as you may know, there are several items that boost our armor. And for this run specifically, I was lucky enough to get all three for the sake of this video. The items are the Carnival Mask, which gives you 4% armor, the Avocado, which gives you 12% armor, and the Shell, which gives you yet another 12% armor. So with the proper RNG, we can guarantee a 28% just with these items alone. However, Engineer is the only class that can achieve the maximum armor bonus without even getting any of these items. So we'll be requiring only three primary skills to be able to make this possible. The first one is the Tempest skill. This skill by itself does not provide any armor, however, one of its two upgrades, named the Frontliner, gives you a 12% bonus when within 6 meters of an enemy. The next skill we'll require is the Chromatic Suit. This skill gives you a whopping 28% armor bonus when you gather enough scrap. And even better, it has an upgrade that adds to the 28% armor bonus, bringing it all the way to 36% bonus, which is quite insane. If you have just the three items and this skill alone, then you're already at max armor. And lastly, there's the Scrap Snack skill. Once again, it doesn't give you any armor up front, but one of its upgrades gives you a 12% armor upgrade every time you activate deploy for several seconds. Just with the skills alone, you're able to get 60% armor. With the items, that could bring you to 88% armor bonus if there were no limits to the armor. However, there is yet another way to gain 8% more armor. There are several weapons in the game, in my experience, mostly the heavy weapons, that can have a modifier called the Armored Modifier, which once you're equipped with one of these weapons, you gain an extra 8% more armor, combining all of these together and you'd be able to achieve 96% armor bonus if there were no armor cap, easily allowing you to achieve the max armor cap achievement you may be struggling for. So that's all for today's video, thank you for watching, peace.